How to make pizza dough. If you're tired of ordering the same old pizza for delivery, make your own customized pizza at home. Give yourself enough time to mix together a flavorful dough and let it prove. Once it's doubled in size, roll the dough into any size pizza or pizzas you want. Pre-bake the dough and then put sauce and toppings on your pizza. Bake it until the cheese melts and the crust becomes golden brown. Step 1. Dissolve active dry yeast in 2 tablespoons, 30 milliliters, of water. If you're not using instant yeast, put 2 teaspoons, 6 g, of active dry yeast into a small bowl. Add a pinch of sugar and 2 tablespoons, 30 milliliters, of the lukewarm water. Stir until the yeast is dissolved and let it sit for 5 minutes at room temperature. The yeast should bubble and foam up once it's activated. If you're using instant yeast, you don't need to dissolve it or add sugar. Step 2. Put the yeast into a bowl with oil, flour, salt, and 7 8 cup, 210 milliliters, of water. If you're using the activated yeast, pour it into a large mixing bowl. If you're using instant yeast, measure 2 teaspoons, 6 g, into the mixing bowl. Add 3 cups, 361 g, of unbleached all-purpose flour to the bowl along with 2 tablespoons, 30 milliliters, of olive oil, 1 and a quarter teaspoons, 7 g, of salt, and 7 eighths cup, 210 milliliters, of lukewarm water. Avoid putting the salt directly onto the instant yeast because it will kill the yeast. You can add the remaining water later if the dough looks dry, but start with the smaller amount. Step 3. Stir the ingredients to make a sticky dough. Use a sturdy spoon, stand mixer, or bread machine to mix the dough ingredients. Stir until they're completely combined and you don't see pockets of flour. If the dough seems too dry, you can stir in the remaining a quarter cup, 59 milliliters, of lukewarm water, a spoonful at a time. If you're using a stand mixer, use the dough hook attachment. Don't use a hand mixer to make this dough because it's not powerful enough to mix the dough. Step 4. Knead the pizza dough until it's soft, smooth, and stretchy. To knead the dough by hand, coat your hands with flour and sprinkle your work surface with a little flour. Use the palms of your hand to push the dough away from you so it stretches. Then turn the dough 45 degrees and fold it in half. Push the dough away again and continue to turn and fold the dough. Knead until the dough becomes soft and elastic. To knead the dough using a stand mixer, choose the second lowest speed and beat the dough for 4 to 5 minutes. To knead the dough using a bread machine, set the machine to run a dough cycle. Thanks for this watching my videos. Please subscribe, like and share.